there's not another human being on this earth that speaks like Farrakhan, that challenges like Farrakhan, that has the wisdom of Farrakhan, even to the Pope of Rome, and all those that you think are wise. Cheers of support for Minister Louis Farrakhan and Father Michael Flager inside a packed St. Sabina Church. Perhaps that is why Facebook wanted to ban him, to keep people from hearing his whole talk, his entire message, and the truth that he seeks to teach us. Flager invited Farrakhan to speak after Facebook banned the Nation of Islam leader last week, citing its policy against those who promote and engage in violence or hate. If you're going to ban Farrakhan from social media, why not ban the president from social media? When one could say, or the black community could say, our president's rhetoric can evoke violence, and it has. Earlier, leaders from the Illinois Holocaust Museum in Skokie joined a representative of the Archdiocese of Chicago at a press conference raising concerns that Flager was providing a platform for bigotry and anti-Semitism. I know words hurt. I have lived through it. And as a Holocaust survivor, I know what was done to me and to us in the concentration camps because of words. We hope that the platform tonight will be focused in a positive way on our common humanity. In a statement, the Archdiocese said Cardinal Supage was not consulted before the event was announced. This is not an Archdiocese-sponsored event. Um, the Cardinal has made clear his support of the First Amendment, and that, um, but that that comes with great responsibilities and calls upon all of us to not use hateful and denigrating language.